So I'm doing the uh, part two video of uh, UI4 uh, as I got so many comments that they want some specific details from the uh, UI4. So first thing I would like to share is uh, that is a new notification options available on the UI4 which is the dark mode, extra dim. So those are the two new uh, shortcuts you can find it on the uh, drop down extra dim is you can dim your brightness little more even your uh, without changing your um, screen brightness so that is more useful if you do not want a bright screen and dark mode you can enable from the um, notification itself so that's another new um, change you can see here and now if you are playing any music it's much more easier to control from your home screen or from your lock screen so let me open the music app so now you can change where the music needs to be played uh, now we have multiple options now it's playing from my phone so now you can change whether you want to play to a different device or to your bluetooth so those things is now easier on your um, widget when you scroll now you will see a, a rubber band effect uh, that's a that's a subtle change if it is end of the scrolling you will see a, a little bouncing effect also now the uh, battery or the system information is completely a uh, redesigned the battery and device care now you have a, a neat uh, separation of informations here like battery storage memory and uh, device protection so uh, for the battery there is a, another uh, new feature that's been added here if you go to the more battery settings now we have one more option called protect battery so this will extend the lifespan of your battery so you can, this is by default uh, disabled now you can enable or disable it as you wish and now the processing speed uh, this is uh, uh, just renamed previously we had a different name now it is having a processing speed so how go uh, whether you want to have your phone optimized or high performance or maximum you can change it here and there is a shortcut for this on the notification too if you look at here um, I saw it somewhere here um, processing speed yep yeah. so that you can uh, increase directly from your notification also and storage in memory doesn't change much it just has the uh, same uh, information nothing much changed on here so the volume button does not change much it's pretty much same as in the version 3 and you can control uh, volumes for difference such as music settings reminders and your um, Bixby everything you can uh, change it's pretty much the same as a user requested I will show you how to add a new um, combination emojis so if you're using a text uh, messaging app or WhatsApp, you can do it with the Samsung keyboard in version 4. So now you will have this multiple combinations. So you will see a plus. So here you can choose whichever the emojis you want to use. So you can choose anything and uh, click on the next and choose what are the variations you have you want so there are multiple options here so you can choose whichever the one you want uh, or whichever is uh, you think you want to do choose that and send so this will send to the user so this is a cool um, new feature which is available on the uh, version 4 Samsung keyboard so now Bixby has more uh, conditions and um, <clears throat> automation routines you can create. So you can go to the um, settings, advanced features and go to Bixby routines. And now you have a lot of new options uh, such as uh, you can schedule something like uh, when you wake up, what is your uh, routine to be or if you get some notifications from a specific person what you have to do so those kind of uh, routines you can add uh, so you can see here all so what is your good morning routine or um, or you can create your own so there are if and then conditions so you can choose for a specific time 
or um, there are a lot of options here so any notification received with a keyboard say for example if you are getting some uh, text from someone who is annoying you want to send an automatic reply so that you can do it now as well as uh, during exercise what you, you can do there are a lot of events has been added here also you have a um, place if you reach some specific place you want to get a notification or reminder so that you can do and you can specify a time on a specific time uh, what you want to do say for example um, during sunrise uh, before or after after sunrise two minutes so what do you want to do if it is that then what do you want to do so you can choose anything you want to do uh, you want to search something or you want to play some music or you want to uh, um, check something uh, anything or if you have uh, a smart things you can turn off your AC or any, anything you can do now there is a little uh, indication on the privacy when you're using a camera or a mic now you can see a green dot on top click a camera you can see a green dot popping up if you pull down your notification you can see and you can tap there and show what's happening so camera is uh, used you're using a, a voice recorder it does the same thing if I press start now you can see there so voice recorder is doing using so so that's another cool uh, change you can see on the uh, privacy uh, that you can you can identify if your mic microphone or a camera has been used by some applications which you are not intend to uh, use if you like this video please give a thumbs up and don't forget to uh, subscribe thanks for watching